What's up, YouTube? Jeff Bannock here. In today's video, we're going to be going over a new app I found called Mirror.xyz. Um, it's really cool. It's going to allow you to do many things when it comes to NFTs. This one line is going to pretty much sum it all. The Essential Web3 Toolkit for Sharing and Funding anything from writing about your newest or your latest idea to building a home for the next big DAO. So if that sounds exciting to you, watch today's video because it's going to be a good one. We'll see you inside. What's up, YouTube? Jeff Bannock here. So this is mirror.xyz. And when you come here, like I said, this is their sort of mission statement. We'll jump into that in just a second. It says create and connect the world on Web3. Very exciting platform I found uh, just recently. And if you look right here, they can do crowdfunding. You can actually do like a Genesis NFT drop right here. Here's someone that created a beginner's guide to NFT and has made 2.28 ETH um, in donations for this. You know, there's um, an entry here. This is the Tour to design framework for speculation. This is like a blog you can do. Uh, here's another crowdfunding. These ones that say entry right here. These are like, um, like I said, like blogs that people have written. You know, across here they've done over crowdfunded um, backers. They've had over 6,600 of those. Your contents forever. This is actually publishes your content on the blockchain. So I thought that was really interesting that like that says, it's like literally you're building your brand forever. So this could be a great platform for a lot of NFTs that are starting out or potentially even people starting out in the Web3 space. They've got 4,300 plus uh, collectors. Uh, they've got, they've raised over 8,000 ETH. They've split up contracts. Well, let's just jump into what this is here real quick. Before we do that, I wanted to read the mission statement. This is the mirror DAO preseason and emerging mission. This is their mission statement. Every uh, community should have a living mission that gets reviewed every season and rewritten once every few years. The clear mission statement serves as a North Star, a call to action, a summary of values for community members. At MiraDAO, we've created our first mission statement and we are excited to share it with you. Over time, we hope it becomes an articulation of our community vibe, a source of wholesome means, and a framework to guide us through tough decisions. And real quick, before we jump into Mirror, Let's read this here. This I think this is important. I think anyone building NFT needs to have a mission statement. And maybe not as elaborate as this. Usually when working with my clients, I recommend like, you know, two to three sentences that really, two is really the, the, the magic sauce, but right around there, that really describe what your NFT is real quick. So when people see it, they're able to know who you are, what you're about, and why they should get involved. A lickety split, you know. So anyway, on a mirror down here, the mirror down mission V01, create uh, great stories together. We are an ecosystem of communities, creators, and builders collabor collaboratively shaping the story of Web3. We believe, believe great stories are created together. Together, we turn our dreams into, into stories and then transform those stories into moments. We believe stories are the backbone of our community development. Together, we nurture a network of mutual uh, support, feedback, and technology to empower the communities in the decent, decentralized future. We believe we can go faster together. Together, we represent communities from around the world and from every walk of life. Our communities highlight the diversity of our spirits. I almost want to stop reading this now. I'm so sorry. We'll be done in a second. We believe innovative compounds to uh, global access to Web3 technology. Together, we are artisans. We create quality crafts for tr transforming our passions, curiosities, and our dreams and reality. We believe thoughtfulness is the cornerstone of self-sustained communities. Holy crap. That is why you only need like two or three sentences. Um, nothing against mirror. I appreciate that. But really, like a lot of that was like fluffy fluff, you know, like you could really have just gotten it down to like, hey, we're about community. We're about telling stories. We're about creating, you know, allowing a vision. You know, like you could have done some. I mean, I know. It, never mind. I'm not going to get on. But anyway, so uh, next thing we're going to look at here is we're going to jump into mirror itself. Once you set up your account, it's literally as easy as logging in to your um, with your wallet. I use MetaMask, of course. Um, and then you'll see this page right here. Now, over the next week, I'm going to be breaking down each of these. I'm going to do a, a video on entries, on crowdfunding, on the splits, the tokens, and the additions. But today, we're just going to do an overview of everything. So again, entries are um, like a blog entry. It's literally you just come in here, you hit your first entry, 
and you start writing about it. We'll get, like I said, we'll get more into that into next videos. Crowdfunding, same thing. You just hit right here. You hit uh, start your first crowdfunding, and you're able to make a crowdfunding based NFT. They do splits, tokens, um, additions can be like, are like your uh, one of minis, and then they have plugins. So these are really cool. So they've got standardly they have i don't know why this one's not clicked right away um but for me when i logged in it wasn't or and uh, the rest were so we had crowdfunding rally support of your audience to fund your next project editions launch a collectible nft with fixed price and limited supply splits direct economic value to collaborators and sources of inspiration tokens mint erc20 tokens to create new communities and distribute ownership so those are the one next four videos i'm going to be doing over the next week and they've got a full guide section that breaks down everything you need to know right here and then in your uh, settings is also where you set up your actual uh uh, profile and put your so your bio in here. Uh, I thought this is really cool. You can set up Google Analytics to go with this. And then if you've got a, a subscription button with links to URL and label enables readers to subscribe to your newsletter or mail list service of choice. So if you've got a link subscribe for uh, whatever email provider you're using, or if you have a newsletter, you can put that right there. You can save it. And then we've got your accounts which this is our identity here. You've got, if you have an ENS, you can put that right here. And then you've got verify email. And then last thing, this is your invitation link where you can actually send people to be able to um, log into your, or not log into, but see the uh, area you've created. And then if you wanna add any contributors or anyone that's able to help work or collaborate on this project with you, you can put in their address or ENS name. I thought that was really cool. And then here's me just as the admin right there. So um, right now, I know that was a pretty quick overview, but I just wanted to do it before I went deep dive because I'm going to actually building out each one of these um, in the next videos and show you step by step how you can actually get started and create all this stuff inside yourself. Plus, we're going to dive more into the actual community and how everything's laid out. Thanks for watching today's video. I'm looking forward to making the next videos for you in the next couple of days. Let me know what you thought of today's video. Give me a thumbs up, please. Also in the comments, let me know what you're using. Are there other platforms that you found that's similar to this? I'd love to be able to review all of them and let everyone know exactly how to use them and what I think of them overall. Thanks again for watching. I'm out of here. Peace.